How's it going guys? And we have another unboxing today. I kind of led you into it on the video yesterday, so I'm glad you're here. But we have some very rare and unique Bakugan stuff in this little package here from Japan. So y'all stick around and we're going to check it out. Alright guys, and I'm ready to get into this thing. And I think I said Japan. I actually think this is from China. Um, but... Uh, I don't want to show you the other side of the box, it's got a dress on it. Um, but uh, a YouTuber, Discord user, Twitter guy, um, I don't want to say his name because I don't want people going asking him for these. What you're about to see are actual prototype versions of some Bakugan Battle Planet stuff. Um, I know one that's going to be in here. Uh, it's actually going to be a Dragonoid core. Um, it's something I asked for. Uh, but he said that he wanted to give me a couple surprises. Uh, because I think the Dragonoid has like a little bit of faulty stuff to it, but it's a prototype, so I was kind of expecting that anyway. Um, so let's see what we actually got in here, alright? Um, we're gonna do... What is, what is that? Oh man. I don't know. Uh, something's on the bottom here. Enjoy the gifts, keep up the awesome work, love Blinks. So, cool. Um, if you know who Blinks is, that's who he is. But, uh, appreciate it, dude. I like the little, uh, I like the little thing you drew. That's cool. Okay, so, um, this is just extra stuff. I don't know what's in here. What are these? Huh. I have no idea. I thought it was going to be extra Bakugan, but now I'm interested. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, they're old Bakugan cards. Oh! Oh! Cool! What are these? Oh man, I have no idea. Okay, hold on. So, uh, main start, main event. What? Okay, that's a dope. All right, I'm gonna look at them here in a second. All right, so uh, this is rubber banded together because yes, it is a prototype, and I can already see like some defects in it. It's actually kind of cool. So, um, go get go get the uh, Pyrus Dragonoid. Um, so I'm gonna show you the. <laughs> so yeah, this is the problem that he was speaking of. So you think our Dragonoids today have the uh, Dragonoid problem? Uh, it looks like they were actually having that problem in um, in pre-production here, because this is like it is springing springing up here. It's actually really uh, really harsh there. Uh, but let's see. Uh, I assume they still open and work. I got some room there. Uh, here we go. No. <laughs> There we go. Okay. Oh, and his feet didn't come out either. Uh, oh, they're actually just manual feet. So, that's actually kind of cool. So, uh, these are manual feet. You can see the screw there. Um, and this is it, guys. There's no paint on it. This is just a really... Oh, my lighting is awful right now. Sorry, I had another lighting problem there. Um, a very rare, because uh, you're not just going to go find these things. The arms actually go back a lot farther than the normal one, too. That's actually kind of weird. So, uh, I guess this was them just working on their spring stuff. The tail is actually um, really hard springy here. I don't know if you can hear that. Uh, but it, it, <laughs> it takes a lot of effort to move the tail. So, uh, this is obviously a very early prototype. Uh, we got some, like, black lineage here for something. I don't know what that's for. Maybe they were uh, working on something. I don't know. And, okay, so full disclosure, I don't know where this comes from. Who got it? Because I know he didn't get them. He just has a bunch of them. And uh, he sent me he sent me one uh, to be cool. Uh, but I, I don't know where these come from or who got them or in what manner they did get them. So um, I'm just happy to have one in my collection. I, I really just wanted one. Uh, I was willing to pay for it. Blinks uh, was pretty cool. And... Uh, just send it my way. So I appreciate him for doing that. But uh, you can see uh, kind of what we kind of ended up with here with the limited edition. So from pre-thought to the most exclusive model, I thought this would be a pretty cool look uh, at what these things became. So uh, pretty crazy stuff. And again, I'm really happy to ha just have this in my collection. Um, I'm just going to kind of keep it off somewhere and kind of just appreciate it for what it is. It's kind of the precursor to what we came up with. Is the tail bigger? No. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Still looking at it. I'm going to take a good look at it later for myself, uh, but I wanted you guys to see this. So, pretty cool. Hope you enjoyed that. All right. So, let's look at these special treats that he sent me. Um, okay. So, I'm assuming these are old Bakugan things. Uh, well, I'm not assuming. I definitely know. Oh, cool. That's a... 
Oh man, I don't know anybody's names. A dark. Okay, so let's just look at these things. So, uh, this I think is not Helios. This is uh, oh no, Darak, right? I think this is Darak. Tell me if I'm wrong. I don't know anything about these old things. Uh, this is the Japanese version, apparently. Um, it says if there is no dark on this battle, who has the lowest number? on some of power level and judge point it's not very good english will win this battle if there is a dark on go on with normal battle rule okay so i don't know what any of that means but that's what it is so very cool uh really good condition card thank you for this appreciate it um and this is called the gate of fire so you get a pretty big bonus on fire there and darkest and uh is that chaos for y'all yeah Okay, I say y'all because I have nothing to do with this game, to be honest with you. These are really good condition. Uh, these are like the best condition old Bakugan cards I've seen. Uh, but thank you for giving me that. That's actually really cool. So it works with my Pyrus there. So really awesome. All right, uh, I don't know what's in here, but uh, this looks like Bakutech stuff. And oh, this is the set list. Oh, that's so cool. Thank you so much. Um, this is like early, early on? Yeah, because a lot of this stuff's not even on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so let me show you guys. This is actually awesome. Thanks, man. This is so cool. Um, this is like the character list for like early on Bakutek, I think. Does it say Bakutek anywhere? It's got the cards and everything. Um, there's one of the older Dragonoids. Sorry, guys. I don't know names of stuff. Sorry. Uh, I, I'm just really not affiliated with this kind of thing. But um, I'm, I'm really looking to get one of these, by the way. Uh, probably coming soon uh, but this is so cool it's got all the stuff from each faction in their own faction that's so cool it's got Helios uh, I guess that's Helios Mark II right um, I know that's really rare it's hard to find uh, come to find out as I was looking for one on the internet uh, but these are so cool man thank you for sending me this I really appreciate that some of y'all probably have a lot more nostalgia for this than I do this is just really awesome because I just like looking at these old Bakugan. It's really, really sweet. Uh, so last thing here. Dang, that's really cool. Appreciate it. Um, I have some cards. And I think... What are these? Are these Bakutek cards? Because... Oh wait, how's this done? Yeah, I think I can... Ah. Okay. Here, let me, uh, let me open these real quick. Alright, so I got these things out of the packaging. He did a very good job packaging there. Uh, so, these, oh, y'all, these are so cool, thank you. Uh, I would have never had any of these if you didn't have done, if you hadn't have done this. So, these are the ability cards for Bakutek. And, I know this guy's name's Panzer, I think. It's called Gaia Shot, name of the card. Saint Friendship. Oh, man, these are so cool, thank you so much. I don't even know what that says. Uh, more stuff. And this is Panzer. Yeah, Grand Panzer. Yeah. God, man, these are so cool. Thank you. They're weird because they're like this cardboard stuff. Another Grand Panzer. Dio Savak. Yeah, that's the name of that guy. I know that. And uh, this is like the bad guy's uh, Bakugan, I think. Not the bad guy, but the antagonist or whatever. God, these are so cool, man. Thank you so much. Now I can actually, like, play Bakutech. <laughs> if I get a couple more, <laughs> this is awesome. Thank you so much. I would have never bought or found any of the Bakutech cards. Uh, and I don't even know if any of these are really good, so sorry if this is, like, really important or not. Uh, I guess I'll go read them later. But then again, I don't even know anything about the old Bakugan to know if these are good. But thank you. Thank you so much. This is the coolest package. I appreciate it, man. Um, this is really cool. But anyway... The star of the show was this uh, Dragonoid here. Um, again, I'm just really happy to have it. It's something that not everybody's going to have. And I just really wanted it in my collection. So I can't thank you enough. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Uh, kind of nerd out all over, over all this stuff. This list, this is just the coolest thing ever. I'm so happy. I'm going to be looking at this for like an hour. But thank you. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate y'all sticking around through this little nerd out session. Um, I hope it was a good time for you, and if you know anything about any of these cards, uh, tell me, because I don't know anything about them, or like these. 
And I think I got this right by saying this is Darak, right? I don't know. <laughs> Tell me in the comments. Uh, but thank you. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.